Okay, so this is my Nano Talon. I'm loving it. I have it about three or four weeks. A lot of fun, a lot more maneuverable than I expected it to be, and plenty of power in the motor. But I don't know if some of you have noticed, it's a it's not that it's unsteady, it just wobbles around the place a lot. Maybe it's the short wingspan uh, and the overall stubbiness. I don't know. But I got an idea. <laughs> Thinking of adding these little cheapy wings from a $2 glider plane with a bit of reinforcement onto the wing like that to lengthen the overall wingspan and perhaps, perhaps make it a bit more steady. So this was just a crude test. I'll work on that and bed that in and see how it goes. Okay, so I've marked out about one third of the way back from the leading edge of the wing, hoping that's going to be the point at which the, the wing would be centered. From there, I'm going to try drilling a hole, a square hole, <laughs> to help insert this as much as possible and then seat it with a bit of hot glue. So this is our end result. Will it help? That's the question. Will it give a bit more stability? Things are scrappy enough underneath there. Try to make it as smooth as possible. You can see that interrupting the airflow. But I don't think the problem is lift as much as stability. So putting those extra tips out there, we just have to see. That's promising. Bring around into the wind. The wings are holding up anyway. Turn, baby. Thank you. Doesn't want to turn right for some reason. Okay, well, that looks quite steady. to land and we pop on the onboard camera. Check the wings. She definitely wants to go to the left. I come in peace, I mean no harm. Just need to get my plane. Okay, well, testament to the build quality. This is the only damage. Something that can be fixed quite easily. Popped out. This broke, which is something that's inclined 
to happen. I've, I've repaired that previously. It's into the workshop for more repairs. Um, but considering the force that she hit the ground, that's not bad going. This is the Achilles heel in, in this design. So not to kind of break too easily, and as you can see already, I, I had attempted a fix. So I leave this rest up until I got it fixed. Okay, so this is the Talon with its modifications. After a few flights, the wingtips are holding up. The real question is, would I recommend this type of modification. And I think my first the first thing I gotta say is I have zero qualifications in mechanics, engineering. I just do the seat of the pants. So I'm not coming to this with any sense of authority at all, other than just an interest in trying something out. Having said that, if this is your only plane, I wouldn't take a chance and stick something like this on. It is affecting the dynamics, it is affecting the inbuilt stabilization. It wasn't designed to have something like this. I tip stalled at one stage, she took a desperate nosedive and didn't recover. I don't know, was that because of ease? It may have been a loose connection here, I'm more inclined to think that, but I can't say. In summary, if this is a plane and you want to shoot FPV and you need steady shots, it might be worth doing this. If you're not interested in FPV and just enjoy the sense of fun of flying this and the power that goes with it and its maneuverability, well then I don't think it's worth trying the tips. So that's my summary. I hope you found this useful and please remember to like and subscribe. Thank you.